As more people search for quick ways to earn money and work from home, experts warn to look out for jobs that sound too good to be true. We asked Team 10 investigator Adam Rakusin to help navigate through what's real and what's a scam. Six and a half million unemployment claims across the country, nearly 900,000 in California, and those numbers are just from last week. The U.S. economy has been hit with an unprecedented amount of jobless claims as workers try to navigate through layoffs and furloughs. We've seen, first of all, a huge increase in the number of people that are looking for a remote job. So Bree Reynolds is a career development manager at Flex Jobs. The online job search website is warning about scammers trying to trick people who may not be used to looking for remote jobs, but are out of work and need money. The company released a list of top job search scams, everything from stuffing envelopes to wire transfers, using your own bank account to cash checks, even product testing. You'll have to test out different technology that you're being sent, like a laptop or a tablet, because somebody's purchased it on eBay, for example, and it turns out that it's stolen goods. Bree says the scammers are after those typical things that you would think, credit card, bank account information, social security numbers, but some also want free labor. We see that a lot with these supposed business opportunities or sales schemes that are really more like pyramid sales schemes, um, where they're just looking for free labor to get more contacts and more people involved. If you're looking for a job, know the signs of a potential scam, like upfront expenses or lots of pay for little work. This one step could help protect you from the start. Not use the phrases work from home and work at home when they're searching online for jobs, uh, because scammers tend to use those phrases more than any others. And legitimate companies will use uh, keywords like remote job, virtual job, and telecommuting. Adam Rakusin, 10 News. For a full list of ways to avoid these scams and others related to the coronavirus pandemic, just head to our website, 10news.com.